Hey there, CUSA family. My name is Cody, and I am super excited to bring you into episode four of our new vlog series. Today, we want to talk to you about savings accounts. Now, if you remember last week, we did talk about savings a little bit. We talked about savings, checkings, and certificates or CD accounts. But I figured it might be a little bit helpful if we took a moment and really did a deep dive in these accounts and really took some practical tips on how to do this. I want to start by saying this. It doesn't matter who you are watching. I believe you can become a saver. Yay! Doesn't matter who you are. You can save. Absolutely. Your financial future is in your hands and you can bring it where you want it to go. It's not always easy though. So I want to give you three practical tips to get the savings account rolling. Number one, it's easy to say, it's hard to do. Change your mind. Change your mind because the way we view money, the way we see money, the way we spend money, the way we talk about money, it's a mindset, right? That's something that we've picked up over time, either from our parents and the way they manage money or from maybe watching social media influencers and you see these young guys who blow money on stuff that they set on fire, foolishness. We just see how society works and we pick up these mindsets you know sometimes we pick up the mindset that we've got to have the latest jordans or the newest console or the new suv or whatever it is all of us are different all of us are in different stages so we want different things but in our mind we equate having these things with success and boo boo that's not the truth stop doing that to yourself The way you win is by having financial freedom and financial stability. Then once you have that, then the other things can come and it's fine and it's great. And you can enjoy what you have instead of having it and then struggling because there's no saving going on. We got to change our mind. It's not the person with the most toys. It's the person with the financial stability. That's the winner. Number two, we won't talk about it long, super easy, open a savings account. I feel like a lot of the times we don't, and it's because we get to feeling hopeless. We get to feeling like, oh, I can't save, I got bills, I got life, I got car notes, interest. I can't save. That's not true. You can save. I promise you can save. Open that savings account. Stop lying to yourself. Stop letting that voice get to you and tell you that you can't save. You can do it. You need a savings. Everybody watching this video needs a savings account. And then the last thing is start small, but don't finish small. What do you mean by that? This is what I mean. I don't want you to call the credit union and tell me that you want to start saving $100 a week when you're not disciplined yet as a saver. Well, why not? Well, it's kind of similar to the tortoise and the hare, right? We all know that old story where the rabbit took off running like wildfire, but somehow or other, the tortoise won, the slower one, slow and steady wins the race, all these old cliches that we've heard, they're true. Start small. When we start too big, we'll wear ourselves out. We'll set ourselves up for failure because if I call you and tell you I wanna save $100 a week, and I still got bills and that's really not reasonable for me that I'm going to have to dip into that to pay my bills and to make ends meet. And the more I dip into it, the lower that's going to go. And then after a while, I'm going to get discouraged. I'm going to stop. So start somewhere where you can start. Five dollars. Y'all, we spend five dollars in America. A bottle of Fiji water, which, you know, bougie me, that's what I drink. Anyway, the Fiji water, that's two fifty. A cup of coffee at Starbucks. Five dollars, one cup. And some of us, we go there every day, whether we're late for work or not, we stop into the Starbucks. One cup of coffee. One. Five dollars a week. We put that on auto savings for you too, which that means every week we can transfer it for you without you even thinking about it. And after a while, you'll start to find out, man, you know what? I really don't miss this $5. I'm actually getting used to it. I don't miss it. Then you can go a little bit further. Let's move up to $10. You know, let's, let's move up a little bit more. 
And then you begin to build and your mindset begins to change and you start to change the way you handle your savings. And slow and steady wins the race. You started at $5 and now you've worked your way up maybe to $100. Maybe you've got some bills paid off now. Maybe you've got some more things taken care of. You paid off this, this car note. Great. Don't go spend that money. Take it. Save it. You can do it. We believe in you here at CUSA. Tell me you can do it. And we actually want to help you save a little bit more. So you know what we did? We brought in a program called Lucky Lanyak Savings. This is a prize linked savings. Super cool, super fun account I want to tell you about real quick and then we're going to be out of here. Prize linked savings. You put $20 into your Lucky Lanyak account, you get a chance to win. This is a collective group of credit unions in Louisiana that participate in this. And so every month we have people who win $100, every quarter one person will win $1,000, and every year one person wins $5,000. On top of that, CUSA has put our own CUSA only people in and they win $50 every quarter. Plenty of chances to win and I'm telling you, we in the year and a half we've had this program, we've awarded our own members over $3,000. Imagine that you start saving, you start putting that $20 in your lucky lineup account, and you get a call from me. Hey, you won $100 this month. You won, we actually have one of our own members win $1,000 just last year. It's a great program. The odds are great. Get in it. Get in it and win it. I'm telling you, it's a great program. Guys, thank you so much. I hope this has been beneficial for you. I hope this has added value. And if you enjoyed this video, I'm gonna ask you to like, subscribe, like, share, and comment, and let your friends know about this. And we're gonna see you next week, and we're gonna talk a little bit about checking accounts and how to manage them. Thank you guys, have a great one.